Welcome back to Hearts of Iron 4, Supplies, Subs, and Spies. Remember where I left off? I am still building a few extra things here because I thought there was going to be a naval invasion of, of Ireland. It wasn't. We're still convoy raiding. And I am researching... Oh, sorry, and sorry, the Axis. I am also researching... Um, cruisers, or have, and now I'm going to have a couple of light cruisers to act as recon, supply scouts and stuff. I'm trying to run low on fuel, so I'm going to see about getting some oil now. And I'll probably keep flip-flopping back and forth between having this and not having it. But Satanta and Deirdre in the same. Main fleet and have them convoy raids. I think Deirdre will get some more experience quicker that way. But actually, no, but let's see what it does. And lots of convoys to raid. I'm saying out the English Channel because it's a shallow sea and submarines are twice as easy to hit to see there. Which I do not want, especially with all these airfields over here to for them to send naval bombers after us with. Speaking of which, our own bombers are nearly ready. They're going to be put on naval on naval strikes with with the cruisers acting as um recon once I get have them ready. Elsewhere in the war, well, the Yanks declared war on Vichy France before I built the bloody railway line in from uh, Tripoli to Gab. I am still I am slightly annoyed at that. And I'm going to build another one here. As you can see, we're getting a new military factory to build more trucks with. After that, I'm going to get this. The massive bottleneck here. Probably because supplies are being threatened by Vichy France. What am I going to go with next? We're short on. Really aluminium we're short on. But not much I can do about that because Ireland doesn't have any. Might as well go with this. Just to give the extra artillery upgrades. Music is... Eh. Escalation. How appropriate. This is the immediate priority. Our escape artist. Huh. <laughs> Get to work. And Kelly, I'm going to put you on the Intel networks here. Take over from her. Use him, actually, but oh well. Construction engineering is not much use to me. So, I am going to go in into naval production. Get these Holland class Bs out sooner, and then the Fomorian class Raiders. Well, cruisers. Anything I want here? And this might this do. That would lower the consumer goods by, what was this? 20%. Hardly worth it at this stage. Oh, and another naval invasion targeting Leinster. Now, I should probably build some uh, coastal forts.
Maybe focus on the coast rather than our single airfields. I suspect what this really means is that they've land one rather than rather than actively are going to do it now. Nice. Last two subs are going. Last submarine should be ready in a month. As you can see, there's a dangerous invasion in the Bismarck Sea. It means there's stuff currently in progress. In this case, they have plans for them, but they're not doing them yet. And I'd be very surprised if they managed. Especially with all the subs and stuff we have. I know it's a little bit early, but let's put these guys out. And they're already damaging the submarines. We already got an ace pilot from that? He's going to buff them a bit. Unfortunately, we lost those convoys. And the Soviet destroyer. I have given some thought to detaching troops to help the war front here, but. We're the back door to England, we kind of, to Britain, we kind of need to keep ourselves safe. Blackburn Shark, that's probably the naval bombers there. Our fires are starting to wreck, our bombers are starting to rack up to have some damage there. Five short and set them in three weeks. Well, that's not a surprise. How long is the rank going to last? After that, I am going to put these through quicker. I'm going to go back to construction engineering here to get get this done quicker. Like it's, we're losing two days on that. That's that's nothing. Bridge of Scuttle the Beach. I think at this point we now have a free reign in Europe to raise hell. Oil processing. Hmm. I'm going to get this. Because it will help build this stuff quicker. And immediately undo that by say for 25 days. And we have a full complement of tactical bombers. I don't know why this is the second bomber, tactical bomber. It's going to come up the first. I don't know why it does that.
I thought they were sharks for a miss. But some rays are kind of shark like. So as soon as I've built those, they'll push forward. So we have 500. Hmm. Let's see if I can modify this to month. Month. How much are we getting? So the weekly production is 24. Multiply that by four, we guess. Need to get a calculator. Ninety-six, and yet somehow we're not losing them. Paradox maths. Can't argue with this. That's not much of a surprise. So, Germany's nearly pushed out of North Africa. You over here, but you, intelligence. It'll take a while for that to come back up, but it'll happen. Separate fire mains. That'll help the um, cruisers once we have them. Our subs are doing work. if I should put them into the Bay of Biscay or the English Channel just to provide some coverage. Because they have they have the range they can provide and they can provide the subs with a little bit of air support. This really is no use to me. If nothing else, we've got a few more railways out here. <laughs> yeah, I've never seen Casablanca. There's a lot of movies I just have never seen, just no interest in. Damn it, we just lost a tactical bomber. That may not have been a good idea. Especially since we have the sub the subs can do the job better, harder to spot, and getting closer. And we are now losing how does it feel? Because of because of the Michael Collins.
Well, naval landing on the, on the Italian mainlands. Yeah, they have not. They're not going to la mass manage that because they've got no supply. Reconnaissance race. Hmm. But it's really that much use to me. So I need 180 more to get these two versus. Hmm, doesn't have the range to cover that. It's probably a dumb idea, but let's see how it works. And we immediately lose ship, lose planes. How many do I have left? Twelve left. Yeah, that's way too risky. What do I go with the streamlined or flexible? Do I go with this? Hmm. Decisions, decisions. Might as well update the defense forces. Sabotage infrastructure, I think. Yeah, all these, all this commando training, plus explosives, they're going to be very good at that. It's good. It means we're going to lose uh, lose our eyes around here, plus it'll screw it'll screw up the German war efforts by by hindering their logistics out to out towards Minsk. That's what I'm telling myself. I want it to be true. I think I can start giving them some artillery. How many of these do we have a month? 1.6 a day. 6 times. 830. It'll average out about 48. Give them a once-off of 300. And then start giving them a few a month.
Should help these guys a little bit. Hmm, do I want to go with him? Maybe. Convoys and certain issues I burnt there lead to try and, and deal with us. So we must be really annoying them now. Oh, that's going to be slow. Need the extra oil now, but quite in the bish. Twentieth of March. Yeah, this really isn't worth the effort. It's like put another naval dockyard in to try and speed it up. I'm not sure if this actually affects them. No, it doesn't. I might as well go into the um, naval production just speed it up a bit even more. Fifteenth of February down from the twentieth of March. That's an improvement. I think once I, once um, D Day happens or whenever, and it's well established, I'm gonna send. Probably at that point, I can spend most of, if not the entire, army over to, to, to hold, help hold the line. Wouldn't be all that glamorous, mind you, but. Rain's affecting that. They pushed in a bit, but Japanese, but not as much as I thought. Bomber is doing work.
I'm not gonna bother with armor in this. I'm just, I'm just not using them. Can't bother with with any of these yet because they're gonna screw over the um, production, factory output, dockyard output. Hmm. Extra root industrial infrastructure might not be a bad shout. I'm gonna go with the streamlined line because we're not gonna be changing them up too much after this. So losing production when we when we change isn't gonna be that big a problem. Thing we're doing is trolley is trolling them with all the, with all these. Denmark still holds the pharaohs. Norway still holds Yan Mayan. Where Iceland is, ah, they joined us. Greenland. Hmm. Maybe I should do a naval invasion of Green of Greenland just for the for the hell of it. Give the troops something to do. Well, it's not like I'm really doing all that much at the moment. Mission prep time. Okay, that's perfectly fine with me. And it would also deny um, Germany this port. There were apparently um, small, small um, special operations teams active from both sides on it through Greenland, basically trying to man and sabotage weather stations. Not exactly. What I would have thought of when I thought of World War II, but oh well. Now the Italians have their big fleet. Okay, this is not going well. Moscow falls. Crap, we lost some tactical bombers. Gonna put these on them, um, training to get them back up to full strength, full XP. And then once they're back up, I'll put them back out on the old patrols again. Yeah, that's not really a surprise. Right, suppose that's probably enough for now. I'll see you in the next one. Here's up and we do better. Bye for now.